I'm sorry, I, I, I completely blinked out. Oh my god. I hate cream. I'll be honest, I thought- I thought we- Danny tried to assassinate the Prime Minister of Malaysia. Keep going. <laughs> hey, that was one time! <laughs> oh my gosh, my name is Captain anyway, Six, and really we are back with Doki Doki Switcheroo. We are we are back with Malakaiza. Hello. Wait, what time is Merp's event? Sorry. Oh my gosh, gosh Danny. It's in an hour and a half. Don't worry about okay. it. Okay. 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 Continuing. Purple, since he was so interrupted. I Ice cream is very good. <laughs> Danny. Privet, I'm about to go get a soda. Oh my gosh, and Psycho. That wasn't a Russian. He broke character. Oh, 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 okay, hold on. Hold oh on, hold no, on. not again, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again. What the fuck did you just say? <laughs> what? Cool. Uh, Welcome uh, back uh, to Doki, Doki Gender Band. I feel a little bit strange that everyone is talking about different idioms. Privet, Gaz, Gazaviko. Wait, did I say that right? I don't know. No, you didn't. Fucking move on. <laughs> Welcome back, to Doki Doki. Welcome back to Doki Doki uh, Switcheroo. Thanks for coming to my channel. Purple, Gazero stop it! Danny, if you don't stop, Zero we're never gonna make it. All right, there you go. All right, so we are gonna <laughs> pick the most Ooh, cutest sorry. thing. So let's start with Marshmallow. Fireworks. Oh, no, fireworks. All right, fireworks why are you doing that? BRB. I'm gonna See, go grab a soda. Sorry. You're trying to rush it without us, and you got it wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Anime, you there you go. You see that? Nipalotsky. Uh, Dang it. Fuck. See, you're trying- you're doing it without any consent. Uh, I'm so sorry. You're getting it I'm wrong. I'm so sorry. Flip! What? Flip! What? <laughs> um, jumpy. No. I did. Flying. Nope. Fuck! <laughs> I wonder- I wonder if jumpy was the answer. I wonder. Now we'll never know. Cheeks! Don't even, don't even know your own character. Excitement. Cheeks. No, excitement, remember emotional things are like Satori's thing. Uh, okay. Donut. Then donut. hair. Donut. Or donut. That Not would work. Dough. Or puppy. Kawaii. Bad. Kawaii. Dang it. Candy. Girl. Okay. Girl. Girl, girl, Fine. girl, good, good girl, good, good girl, friend. Nice. Boop. <laughs> Whistle. Whistle. Kitty. Uh, kitty. Nile. Kitty. Oh yeah, kitty. Okay. Uh, parfait. Food. Yeah. Skirt. Greed. Spark. <laughs> Greed. <laughs> Destruction. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see. Um. Dog. Yeah. 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 Uh, no. Oh, well, no, 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 no. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Can't do uh, it too hasty mouth, here. I saw your mouse go go to it. That's that's a little hasty. Blanket. Dazzle. Dazzle. Are we, are we ah, dazzle? it was no. fun. No, it was blanket. I was like, I I tried to ask, and then there was no confirmations, and cat went. I'm just saying. Wow. Okay then. Um, milk. Milk. Yeah. It's food. Anything food related. No, it's uh, kissy kissy mew mew. <laughs> kissy, 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 mew, mew. kissy mew mew. <laughs> Jesus. Two, actually. Two is better, apparently. Oh, another day passes and it's time for the club meeting already. I've gotten a little co more comfortable here over the past couple of days. I enter the club room drowsily. Natsuko and Mateo aren't here yet, and Yuri's, and Yuri's busy reading his book. Satori is sitting at a desk across the room with his face resting in his hand. He's probably ex as exhausted as I am. I quietly slip into the seat next to him. Yo, Satori. Don't you yo, Satori me. Well, someone's grumpy today. Gee, I wonder why that is. I smile a little to myself. Yesterday after school, Satori came over to hang out and we ended up playing video games. All at night. What time did we stop playing? God. Damn. 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 What? Damn. 
<laughs> really, man? You gotta like knock down the whole entire room on your way back. <laughs> what kind of avalanche? I'm sorry. I stepped on plastic. That's it. <laughs> Freaking avalanche happening in the room. God, dude. God. You know what we're playing that game? Look at earthquake. Oh my God. Oh. I went to go grab food. <laughs> Why can't you eat before recording? Give me a sec. We just Give started. Cause Uber Eats takes too- it takes a long time. Danny, I get with drinking while recording <sighs> because you- because you don't make sounds during drinking, but eating a bag of chips? The noisiest snack. <laughs> You're welcome. Fine, I'll grab my nuts. Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> Alright, I have my almonds. Oh my gosh, continue Malakaiza. We fell asleep at four. We fell asleep at around four. The council was still on when we woke up. We didn't stop playing. We simply passed out. You know, I only agree to come over if you promise to turn the games off at a reasonable hour. But you didn't. And now we both look like zombies. That's not true. I don't see any eye bags anywhere over here. I hope you're happy. Hear that? <laughs> well, Get on. I am. And you should be too. We may be tired, but at least we had fun. Besides, all we need is a little snack to boost our energy. I'm starving. Me too. Do you have money? No. Do you? No. I look over at Yuri and give Satori a playful nudge. Hey Satori, let's ambush Yuri and rob him. I highly recommend you don't. <laughs> what? I can steal his I'm nuts. eating nuts. <laughs> I you really shouldn't do that on camera, man. I wouldn't. What Don't interrupt him. Time. Okay. Just... You hold him down, I'll take his wallet. Are you insane? <clears throat> I can hear everything you two are saying. In any case, that would be a po it would be pointless to assault me. I haven't any money either. Besides, you should only buy what you can responsibly afford. <laughs> <laughs> Like an eyewash station, you can afford those. <laughs> I wasn't Shut gonna up! say anything. <laughs> no, I just find it funny that you're saying this and at the same time you're just like putting down a giraffe. Yeah, yep, I heard yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you. Yeah. and cat are like <laughs> ambushing you for like food for money. <laughs> <laughs> food for money? <laughs> money for food. <laughs> I'm just I'll like, I share you. And I have no money to spare. Opens up a bag of chips and just starts eating. No money. Right. No cracks. No money. <laughs> I have no money because I spent it on my soda at my nuts. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> You're in the middle of a line. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, I forgot for a second. <laughs> okay, hold on. Oh my god, dude. <clears throat> at least what I'm eating is And quiet. frankly, after you pulled that irresponsible little stunt last night, your suffering is fair enough retribution. Jeez, dude. Jeez. Oh, fuck. <laughs> no. Um, uh, did, did I just... <laughs> I, I, I didn't mean that. <laughs> I, I, I just got too absorbed in my book. What the hell is he reading? How to be a serial killer in ten easy steps? How'd you know? <laughs> Good book. No worries, Yuri. I like when you speak your mind. Hmm. It... Doesn't happen often, but it's a fun side of you. Thanks, Satori. Suddenly, Natsuka walks in. He. Yo, what up, bitches? What's poppin'? <laughs> <laughs> Not for one second. <laughs> <laughs> he appears to be in a chipper. Party in the house. <laughs> Just when I thought he couldn't get more annoying. As he greets us all before making his way to a desk in the back of the room. I put my nose to the air and sniff. There's that sweet scent again. Satori notices my demeanor change. Hmm? 
Do you smell something? I continue to sniff the air excitedly. Satori sits up. What is it, girl? The little Timmy fell down the well again? <laughs> what do you smell? Sniff it out! My eyes become locked on Natsuko, who is cheerfully pulling a notebook and pencil out of his bag. The scent intensifies when he unzips the bag. I look at Satori confidently. Our stomachs rumble deeply. All Shoddy logic got cookies. <laughs> All logic gives in to desperate hunger. We both get up and swiftly make our way towards Natsuko. Animals. Hey guys, how's it go? He trails off. Satori takes a seat on one side of him, and I take the seat on the other side, circling him like sharks. Our unblinking gaze are locked. <laughs> are locked on Natsuko's confused face. He fidgets nervously. Uh, what are you guys staring at? You smell like cupcakes again. Natsuko becomes increasingly nervous. He looks at Satori for mercy. <laughs> We're starving, Nat. Where are they? Natsuko looks back at me, visibly sweating. Come on, dude. We're languishing here. In sheer panic, Natsuko <laughs> finally peers at Yuri. Yuri? <clears throat> um, it would be best for you to relinquish your sweets unless you wish for them to uh, feast on you instead. Yuri! Have a nice day. <laughs> Yuri doesn't even take his <laughs> eyes off his book. Something tells me that even if our intentions were aggressive, Yuri would continue nonchalantly reading. Satori and I lean in closer, trapping Natsuko like even more. I'm trying to figure out the best ways to be a serial killer. Excuse me. <laughs> Step six. <laughs> Nat, feed us. Finally, Natsuko stomps his foot in defeat. You two are bullies, you know that? Ugh. Ugh, fine. Here, you pair of ravenous wolves. I was gonna share him anyway. Natsuko reaches into his bag and pulls out a tin. He tosses it on the desk behind him. The top pops off from the forest, revealing a variety of beautifully decorated fancy cookies. The fuck are you laughing at, Satori? <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, you really liked that one, didn't you, man? Oh, no, no. I think we're it's... laughing at you. No, we're laughing at uh, you, Dan. Mm, fair enough. Your nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Keep you know, oh my God. I mean, I, I would have offered, but, you know, some people thought it was awkward. <laughs> but Besides, that's, you know, Natsuko's everyone's favorite, so. Aww, so weird are you so mad at that? Aww. <laughs> Get fucked, bro. <laughs> Socks. Are you still mad at that? Sorry, I think Socks. I smell Socks. last place in here. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Alright, I you were What? You poor thing. <laughs> Without thinking, Satori and I are on it instantly. I can only imagine the gri the grimacing looks on Yuri's and Natsuko's faces. The noises we make as we the noises we make as we devour the cookies are probably horrific from their perspective. In seconds flat. Oh, and they are. <laughs> Worse than me eating my nuts. <laughs> Yeah, you have no room to talk eating your nuts in the middle of class. <laughs> in seconds flat, we both retreat. It's after school. Leaving behind only a few broken cookies at the bottom of the tin. Yeah. God, you practically ate them all! You savages! Here, you forgot to eat the tin! Natsuko tosses the tin across the room in our direction. Yuri gives oh, an amused <laughs> chuckle. Satisfied, <laughs> Tori and I trot away to safety. That sugar boost was just what we needed. <laughs> I love eating my We're sorry, Nat. <laughs> oh. That's Kat step number three. <laughs> Kat and I were so hungry. We owe you one, okay? I love how we never pay him back. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> he's, gonna, he's gonna die. <laughs> like, you guys are gonna be like, oh. Yeah, we'll pay you back. Die. One. One! <laughs> Well, I mean, this is Natsuko's route, so I have a way to pay him back. Don't do that here. You Wait, what? Buy your batch, you bottomless pit. I meant okay, like okay. I <laughs> meant like a freaking kiss on the cheek or something. Walmart oh. has two five sale. 
What did you think I meant? I'll <laughs> talk about this later. Continue. <laughs> after class, after class. After class. <laughs> Jeez, Mateo, can you please tell these two? Huh? Natsuko glances around. Mateo isn't here. Yes! Where's fuckboy McGee? I haven't seen him all day. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. <laughs> Ever consider he has an actual social life? No. What the fuck are you doing, kid? Do I look like I have a social life? No. I didn't think so. Frankly, frankly, yeah, you can't you do. But okay. <laughs> Not wearing that sock for nothing. Oh my Are God. you fucking kidding my me, Dad? What the hell, man? Why in the <laughs> okay, world? I'm <clears throat> I've been wondering that as well. Do you know anything about him, uh, where he might be? I haven't heard anything. Cat? I cease picking cookies out of my teeth for a moment and look over at Satori. What? Have you seen Mateo today? Fortunately for me, I have not. Hmm. He's bullying. It's not like him to be late. He's actually quite pun- mm. He's usually quite punctual. He's normally quite punchable. <laughs> no, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> well, calm down, he probably just had something to do today. Or someone. Get out of here, you preschool. <laughs> no, sorry. Satori and Natsuko <laughs> chuckle a little. I have already checked out the conversation and gone back to licking co cookie crumbs off my teeth. Maybe Mateo has a... You know. Satori winks and nudges me. Mateo is something, and apparently I'm to guess what it is. Maybe I should have been paying attention to the conversation. Um, a colonoscopy appointment? A therapy appointment? Oh, a brain transplant! No. <laughs> Only one for me. <laughs> Satori gives me a blank stare. Clearly, that wasn't the answers he was looking for. Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Wow. Your ability is too flawlessly... Oh my god. Your <laughs> ability to flawlessly read social clues is astonishing. You could tell he just went by. <laughs> Shut <laughs> up! I meant, maybe he has a girlfriend. Well, he's pretty popular after all. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my mom is yelling at me. Hold on. <laughs> it's okay, I'll cut this out. Psycho, right, pick up the slack. The tail's probably where. <laughs> uh, Psycho, you take over. The tail's probably okay. where. <clears throat> all all right, never mind. Shut up, Psycho. Many of us can go. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, we're all, you know. Antisocial and probably pretty ugly. Probably. <laughs> well, I'm looking at you, Shorty. Ooh. I'll punch you in the sock. <laughs> Good thing I have padding. <laughs> and a stocking after all. <laughs> That's true. He only comes once a year. Eh? Speak for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> The door swings open. Mateo rushes inside. Apologies, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my dad was showing me something. I didn't mean to be late. I was getting it. What? Mm -hmm. Um. I hope no one was worried. If it makes you yeah, feel better, right. I didn't notice nor care. He looks at me from the corner of his eye. You son of. Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Back again, I see. Haven't given up yet, have you, sport? <laughs> <laughs> you won't be getting rid of yeah, me boy. that easily. Psycho, why'd you sound like my dad? I didn't like that. <laughs> <laughs> I am your dad. Okay. <laughs> what you sound like? 
I'm impressed by your determination. Let's see if you can keep it up. Oh my god, I am... I was doing a mic check on myself. Why were you late today? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was muted! <laughs> Girlfriend problems. Mateo looks to Satori with a very bewildered expression. Girlfriend? I don't... I don't have... Who is she? Mateo trails his sentence before scoffing and looking away. I guess he's I single. Know. I wonder why that could be! No, 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 that's not the reason I was late. Just crying in the bathroom alone. So, why were you late? Mateo darts his eyes crying over to me. Crying in the bathroom alone. Again. I thought you didn't care. Oh, I didn't. But talking about it seems to bother you. So now, I'm all ears. I expect him to snap, or at the very least ignore me completely. But, to my surprise, he gives me a little smirk. Well, not that it matters, but my last period today was study hall. To be honest, I kind of just lost track of time. How'd you not hear the bell? There's the angry glare I was expecting. But for some reason, he reserves it for not Natsuko's <laughs> question. If you must know, I didn't hear it because I was practicing guitar. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah. <my> ears! <laughs> Sorry. That's why Dan's down at 80% for me. <laughs> Fuck yeah! I have, to yeah. I have to get it up to 200 for him because of recording. 80% game! <laughs> Everyone in the room. I turned myself down for that. Everyone in the room looks a bit surprised by this information. <clears throat> uh, guitar? I wasn't aware you played a musical instrument as well, Mateo. Yeah, but guitar? That's weird. I'd expect someone like you to play a fancy instrument. A piano, or violin, or fufuzela, <laughs> or something. Mateo rolls his eyes in annoyance. Of course I can play piano. Easy. I've been playing piano since I was four years old. What the fucking smell off your face, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Every Saturday in the York, oh, no, I it. was a prodigy, they all told me. <laughs> I just wanted to try something different for once. That's pretty cool. You should play for us all sometime. No. <laughs> No. There you go. Mateo suddenly looks at me. I will soon, once I get a little better. What the hell is he looking at me for? I didn't even say anything. C-R-U-S-H. Yeah. Your face. <laughs> yeah. I know I'm better than you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he's thinking. And she's like, I'm way misinterpreting it. <laughs> I play guitar. <laughs> uh-huh. Fuck you. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. And perhaps you will be there as well, Cat. Be the light to play for you if you manage to stay in this club long enough. Mateo smiles sweetly. Why is he being so... His version... Dickish. ...of nice all of a sudden? Uh, yeah. Looking forward to it. You are quite confident to. to <laughs> Thanks, you! Alright! <laughs> you are quite confident about your ability to stay in the club, aren't you? Yeah! <laughs> I like that. In that case, I can't wait to show you what I can do. He smiles at me again. There's something. I don't like that. Oddly suggestive I about do. that smile. It makes me feel a little... Mateo, I'm gonna be honest, I liked it better when you were an asshole. <laughs> it makes me feel a little... I'm excited to see that, Mateo. Oh, I bet you are. 
your Latin cat. <laughs> the way that you said it in the freaking mic in my ears <laughs> is so <laughs> bad. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Today's going to be a good episode because I just remembered what poem we're going. reading today. Uh, it's something uh, no, it's <laughs> Uh, I believe today's episode, I get to read the the the, the perfume commercial. Oh. Yes. Yes. Oh. I hate you guys. Good luck to you. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Mommy. Oh my god. Charmander. <laughs> Charmander. So, did I miss anything? Satori and I both snap our heads towards Natsuko, expecting him to towel on us for inhaling his tin of co cookies. Hold on. He eyeballs us for a moment, but in the end, remains silent. I turn back to Mateo. <laughs> nope, everything's been normal. I'm sure Natsuko will bring it up to him eventually. I look around. When Natsuko tattles. <laughs> I look around. <laughs> Everyone has already begun to settle in. Yori's back to his book, and Natsuko wanders back into the closet. You know I am. Hey! Did you finish that manga last night? Oh yeah, I forgot about the terrible manga. <laughs> it was not terrible! <laughs> a work of art. It's okay. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> what manga? <laughs> 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 what manga? You need what manga? Oh, his face! Oh no, I feel bad. The manga we read together yesterday that I gave you to take home and finish. Oh, Psycho, that is not fair. The way you're saying it you're is ass. not fair. <laughs> <laughs> the way you're saying it is not fair. It's too cute. Kind of gay, not gonna lie. <laughs> I shrug. My God. No idea what you're talking about. The color drains from Natsuko's face. You know exactly what I'm talking about! You took it home with you to read last night! Now where is it? Oh, that manga! Right! I accidentally dropped it in the toilet! You can have it back, but it's kinda gross. Yeah! Are you serious? Oh no. Unable to keep this up any longer, I finally break and start laughing. <laughs> Chill out! I'm only joking! Natsuko gives a massive sigh when I pull the manga volume out of my bag and harm. I smirk. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, it's... wait, no! I'm not gonna say that! That's stupid! <laughs> you gotta say it! It's the line! <laughs> you gotta <laughs> say it! It's so stupid! Yo, Chad! Dog. We're done. Whoa, time for... Whoa, time for us to hang ten, bruh! Looks like that wave of relief is back! <laughs> oh, shut up, you troll! You almost gave me a heart attack! Oh, that face! Hey, that was a good one and you know it. <laughs> Admit it. Fine, fine. It was a little funny. No, it wasn't. Now give it back. <laughs> 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 he snatches it from me and promptly begins to inspect it. He gives another sigh when he discovers it is in the same condition it was when he gave it to me. Oh, it's almost like you didn't touch it. <laughs> <laughs> it's still in one piece. I'm not careless, almost you know. Almost like you never opened it. Just making sure. Can you blame me for being paranoid? I don't just give people my comics every day. Anyway, let's put this one back and grab the next one. Natsuko and I head to the closet. I'm excited for you to tell me what you think so far. Where did this volume leave off again? Oh, he came out the closet! Oh my gosh, Danny! <laughs> I was thinking about saying it, but I didn't. Me, me when Yuri says I a got thing. You. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Oh, hey, OBS, how you Hi. doing? Hi! See, the I difference is, uh, Yuri doesn't look gay. That's true. Sorry. Yo, what the heck? Right. Wait, was that a gun or a water so... bottle? I can't tell. So, <laughs> it left- Because if it's a gun, it sounds like this. 
so it left off. Dan, I have questions. <laughs> yeah. What's what's up? You can talk about it after. <laughs> <laughs> I live in Texas, okay? Steak and you know, like steak and guns. So it left off uh. where Mochi and Aki found. Son of a. But Taro, did he move my stuff again? Natsuko's yes. voice resonates Sucks out of the closet. Suck. I peer inside. All of Natsuko's books... <laughs> out of the closet. <laughs> All of Natsuko's books are lined up on the top shelf. Aw, oh, he can't reach. I had to. It's so funny when you react to it. <laughs> the teacher got mad at me for taking up so much space in the closet. So I like, cleaned up a bit and moved some stuff around. Got a problem. Me too. He's mad because he can't reach it. Ah! I see! And what part of your brain decided to take the shortest guy's stuff and put it on the top freaking shelf? The comedy side. <laughs> I second that. No, stop whining. All your crap is still there. Just get it, forehead. Can't get it. Ugh. Shut up. Look up. The top shelf is far above Natsuko's head. Honestly, how does Mateo expect him to be able to reach? Ladder. <laughs> I watch as Natsuko makes a few, makes a few. Just don't reach. I watch as Natsuko makes a few. Read a real book for once! Danny! <laughs> I watch as Natsuko <laughs> makes a futile, a futile hop, trying to figure out how to reach it. He finally turns to me. Can you please help me get these back down? Plenty of room up on these shelves. Uh, sure. There's a stool on the wall there. We can use that. There's a collapsible stool hanging on the wall. I like how Mateo is just here and didn't even help him. I like it how it says <laughs> yep. collapsible yep. stool. Perfect. I see some Describe foreshadowing. That's a foreshadowing. I'm in the back of the class watching Perfect. them. Perfect. Stool. I'll reach up there and pull them down. And I'll hand them to you and you can put them back on the lower shelf. Wouldn't it be easier if I reached up there and handed them to you? Nah, it's okay. I can do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. Natsuko takes the stool from the wall and unfolds it. He hops on. It's wobbly due to its collapsible design. I sense foreshadowing, and I'm trying to prepare myself. I watch anxiously. I'm not much taller than him, but I could definitely reach the boxes more easily. Standing on the stool, Natsuko's fingertips reach the top shelf. He uses his fingers to scoot one of the smaller boxes to the edge of the shelf. The box suddenly tips. I barely catch it before it falls onto the floor. The stool wobbles. Losing his balance, Natsuko jumps down. Thankfully, he was able to stay on his feet. Having almost fell, he's clearly a bit shaken. I slide the box on the lower shelf and turn to him. You alright? Yeah, um... So, you know the idea you had a few minutes ago that was perfect and actually made sense? <laughs> That's something you would actually say to I love that. <laughs> Maybe we should just go with that. Reach the bigger boxes for me. Could you please? Aww. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Why does he have to be so cute and innocent looking? Well, he said please. I smile and nod. Of course. But I'm not standing on that stool. I don't trust it. I'm using a chair instead. Where are the chairs in your desk attached to them? You won't be able to fit those in this closet. Hmm, good point. Let's see. I scan the classroom. Aha! I spot a computer chair behind the teacher's desk. I roll it on its wheels back to the closet. Words said before back disaster. <laughs> is that. Is that safe? 
swivels and rolls. They're gonna get hurt. Not if you hold it steady. Come here. Natsuko comes over and grabs the back of the chair, bracing it with his body weight. I climb up on the seat and slowly stand, trying to keep my balance. The chair only moves once under my weight, but Natsuko steadies it instantly. I gotcha. Great. We'll be able to do this in no time. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no! I remember! I remember! I'm wearing a freaking John? skirt! Oh, sorry. I'm wearing a Just skirt! Keep... And he's... Let's keep going. <laughs> As I adjust my glasses, just keep going. Just keep going. Actually, let me get my glasses off. <laughs> right, you may continue. Oh my gosh. I reach up and grab the first box of comics. It's not very heavy, so I'm able to bend down and slide it onto the lower shelf. I wrap my arms around the bigger box. Whoa, this one is very heavy. Ugh. Hey, Natsu. This box weighs a ton! I won't be able to bend down to that shelf without falling. Here, try to take it! I bend out as far as my strength will allow, but I don't feel Natsuko taking the weight off- uh, taking the weight of the box. Hurry up, man! The stuff is heavy! My arms start shaking. The only thing I get from Natsuko is a weird sounding grunt. What the hell is he even doing?! <laughs> Hey, Natsu! I turn my head around and- Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I see Natsuko. Eyes wide, cheeks red, mouth agape, looking right on my skirt! I knew it! <laughs> nah. What a fucking perv. Come on, man. <laughs> you dog. Have some decency. I forgot I was still in school uniform. <laughs> At least don't make it obvious. And while I usually oh, keep my blazer tied around my waist as a shield, it must have come untied at some point because I suddenly feel very exposed. There's no doubt he can see everything. I would have never asked him to do this if I had remembered just what the hell I was wearing. Hey, hey, hey! What do you think you're doing down there? Stop it! Finally snapping out of it, Natsuko suddenly realizes what he's just been caught doing. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm uh, sorry, uh, sorry, sorry. I won't look. Natsuko turns away and covers his face with, face with both hands, letting go of the chair. It instantly starts to swivel and roll. Gah! Natsu, grab the chair! Sorry! I didn't mean to look! Dude, just grab the chair! I'm sorry! I want to help! He must have uncovered his eyes for a split second because I hear him exclaim again. Oh god! <laughs> I'm sorry! I looked the agony! I don't care anymore! Just grab the chair! I'm trying! I briefly notice Natsuko blindly grabbing the chair around the- <laughs> grabbing at the air around the chair. He can't bring himself to open his eyes long enough to stop it from moving! Ah! Cat! I've got you. The chair finally rolls out from under me. Frantically, Natsuko tries to catch me. The box topples out of my hands and the books go flying. The full force of my body throws Natsuko to the ground. A whole bunch of books pelt us in the face and head. I try to shield the back of my head with my hands. Oh, my body definitely felt that one. I slowly come to my senses. I sit up, pressing my arm down into what I think at first to be the floor beneath me. <laughs> I hear an exasperated grunt. I look down and realize it's not the floor I'm sitting on. This went so much better than expected. <laughs> There's a clear reason why I put those books on the top shelf. <laughs> and it worked so much better than I thought it would. God, I love this club. <laughs> Feels good to be king. <laughs> <laughs> I glare at Natsuko <laughs> momentarily before grabbing him by the labels of his blazer and jerking his upper half off the ground. He looks nervously into my eyes, his face still blazing red. Natsu, when I tell you to grab the chair, you grab the frickin' chair! 
I shake him back and forth with each syllable. <laughs> Sorry! He manages to whine pathetically between each shake. I release my grip, dropping him back to the floor. Then I pound my fist into his chest. <coughs> and that's for being a pervert! I place both his hands I place both hands on his chest and press my body weight against him, them, hoisting myself up. Natsuko gives another groan as I step on him on my way to the nearest desk when I drop myself in the seat. Right oh me. shut up! I hate you for you guys, you guys doing okay? <laughs> Body hurts. <laughs> that thought I heard something going on. Everything over there. is Peachy yeah. King. I practically screamed the last part in rage. I stand from the desk, even though my legs are now as wobbly as a as that stool. Next time the teacher asks you to clean the closet. Leave not to stuff in the middle shelf from now on! Unless it's your desire to kill off your club members one by one! Jeez. You sure do like to exaggerate things. Don't you, Cat? Spoken like someone who didn't see me plummet face first to the floor! Oh, so I did. Mateo leans over and inspects my face very closely. Okay, that's a little bit too close. Hmm. Well, you certainly don't look like you've damaged that pretty little face of yours. Wait, what? He's flirting with you. That's what flirting is. <laughs> this is called flirting. <laughs> so why worry? I want to punch you in your face. I blush intensely at Mateo as Mateo gives an amused chuckle before returning to the front of the room. <laughs> Imagine like a popcorn in my hand, I just throw it up and catch it in my mouth. <laughs> the compliment catches me so off guard that I forgot to mention Natsuko's little stunt. I look down at him. He's still laying on his back on the floor, staring for forlornly at the ceiling. I gingerly approach him and kneel down. He turns his head the other way. Today is the day I die. <laughs> this is the spot. <laughs> Thanks. For not telling Mateo, I mean. I, I really am sorry, you know? Yeah, well... You're lucky I didn't say anything. Even though it was kind of my fault. But if you try to pull that crap again, I'll... Natsuko's face suddenly becomes indescribably sad. My eyes travel in the direction he's looking at, and, imme and it immediately becomes clear why. Oh no! I quickly reach over and pick up one of the books that's scattered on the floor. There's a long diagonal crease on one of the pages. I desperately try to smooth it out. Crap, I must have landed on the page! I try a bit more to fix this crease, but I can't get it out! Suddenly, Natsuko reaches over and takes my wrist gently. Hey. It's okay. Don't worry about it. His voice is calm and quiet. It somehow sounds deeper than usual. But it's... your childhood. He chuckles sadly and looks down. Yeah, well... I never said it was the best childhood. He seems so distant all of a sudden. Natsu, this isn't about the manga, is it? Still on the floor, he curls up on his side and turns away from me completely. Anything I could do to help? Natsuko shakes his head. Do you want to talk about it? No. <laughs> Every day. It's just the same thing. I just... Just want to come to the club and... Just want to be... He falls silent. I stare helplessly. 
Whatever anger I was feeling regarding his little peep show has dissipated. I want to talk to him about whatever problems he may be having. But I can't very well pry if he's not ready to open up. I decide to do the only thing I can right now. Well, I'll get these comics and these comics and manga organized and moved for you. I grab volume two of Captain Kid and set it aside. Except this one. We'll get started on it as soon as I'm done. Maybe that'll help you maybe that'll help make your day a little better. I start collecting the books and putting them in their respective sets. As I reach for one, Natsuko reaches out and gently takes it first. You're... You're really nice to me. Thank you for that. I'm... I'm not used to someone being nice to me. I... I appreciate that. I have a lot of respect for you. Remember, there's no height limit on being a cool and interesting person. Natsuko smiles sadly. I don't know what might have happened to him today, but helping him boost his self-esteem is the least I can do. The next couple of minutes are quiet as we begin to gather the scattered books. We place them in the correct order. We hoist the box together and set it on a shelf Natsuko can comfortably reach. I get up the courage to stand on the wobbly stool and get the rest of the boxes down. All right, that should do it. I hop off the stool. Thanks again, Kat. Anytime. Natsuko was holding the volume I set aside. Shall we? He smiles a little. Looks like he's starting to cheer up already. All right, I'm ready. We sit in the same spot as last time, and I open the second volume. Natsuko's mood continues to improve as, as he laughs and points things out to me. He's surprisingly sharp, making note of all, making note of a lot of subtle, repeated jokes and background elements. In the end, I'm pretty impressed with how well everything ties up in in the story, despite Natsuko saying the story doesn't hold up. I guess he has good taste after all. After some time, Mateo gets our attention as usual, and it's time to share poems again. Guess I'll be holding on to this for now. Yep. And hey, you found some more enthusi- you sound more enthusiastic this time. No. Fuck! <laughs> hey, hey. You good? <laughs> I dropped my water bottle. You okay? You found more- God! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Well, I'm starting to get into it. I knew you would. I return to my seat and put the book in my bag. Who should I show my poem to first? And we will stop there. This is this was very short today. Um I really wanted I wanted to interrupt you guys right when you sat down. And be like, alright guys, time to share our poem. <laughs> But I was like, God, do I really want to ruin it right now? Psycho would probably have killed you, and I would have probably laughed at it. <laughs> yeah. I was like, should, should I really ruin this right now? <laughs> I hope that you guys like this. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. We have two videos that um, are over 1,000 views, and that is part one and part four. Wait, really? Uh huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh my god, epic! <laughs> I was drinking ice cream. What? I was drinking ice cream? <laughs> it melted. All right, I told you it's hot in my house. What again? Well, I hope that you, guys, I hope that you guys like it. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends, family, anyone who you think that will like this. Um, and let's go with the end credits, starting with purple. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Go me last. I'm fact check. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh my god, then. it actually has over a thousand views now. Yo! Mm -hmm. Yo, what? Yeah. has <laughs> two! Yeah! Yo! Now, okay, then let's start with Malachi for end credits. Hello guys, thank you for tuning in. I'm Malachi, and you can follow me on YouTube, uh, Malachi, and find me on Twitter, Malachi's VA. Thank you. 
All right, now Danny. Hi, I'm Daniel, uh, lead singer of band. Go check it out. That's it. <laughs> what band? What band? <laughs> X Clicks. There we go. You okay, Dan? <laughs> no. Aww. We'll talk about it later, buddy. Okay, Psycho. Hi, I'm Psycho, drummer of band. Go check it out. <laughs> you guys are so oh, you're a drummer mean. now. Yeah, I, le I started learning the drums. Nice. And last but not least, yeah. Purple. Hey, I'm purple. I stream on Twitch. Oh my <laughs> gosh, you guys are so bad. <laughs> All right. So I stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash purple turtle 207. And I am going to be using a v Roid character for all my streams now. So if you want to see that, if you want to ask how it's done, I'm go. Not I'm not <laughs> I <laughs> might that ask. sucks, nerd. <laughs> I hope my ass. All right. Um. Ask what? <laughs> I said ask how it works. I might ask. Oh, I'm okay. I, I might <laughs> ask and then nothing else. <laughs> also, um, we are going to have... Um, it's been confirmed that we are going to be playing um, Act 2 as soon as we're done with all of these routes and we're finished with Act 1. We're going to do um, Act 2, which is um, a little bit of Act 2 that the creator made as long as she gets to be there. So the creator is going to be there for act two. Yeah, we mm -hmm. get for bibs, don't yeah, we? we? We get connections, mm -hmm. my guy. Hell yeah. So yeah, this is really fun. I can't I can't believe that we're doing all this. And I'm so happy that you guys are along with the journey. My hand. My hand is shaking. I can't believe we got one <laughs> on two of those. And, and hey, it's one Dude, with, your, it's one with Mateo's one. name. It's two. one with Mateo's no. name. Mateo if, is acting creepy. If we get first, <laughs> look at if that. If we get first dibs on Act Two and then I advertise that, that you on know, the upload, it it's gonna be epic. It is gonna be epic. Yo, seriously. I can't wait for that. Ooh, I'm All excited. Right. Yo, you're gonna be the one person that everyone mooches on. <laughs> Let's go. Hell yeah. Views. It's gonna be a lot of views. <laughs> I can't wait. But I hope that you guys have a wonderful day or night wherever you guys are and shine brighter than the galaxy, my little stars. Bye! Remember to sub. Sub. <laughs> now. <laughs>